Okay guys, welcome back. Kenapa update yang konten? So, ini nak komen komen tu start install the windows. I'm gonna start to do all the detail work uh, on the columns and all that. I'll see what going on. Putting the steps to height now, because um, that's gonna be sandwash finish. And I'm painting the fascia board. So we're finishing off the painting. And you see the bones in lip, that's the trim going around the windows, that's in. Catman's on. Most of the building. He's tight fit. So Gloria and Epp, they're doing the cutouts. For the trim work on that, internal trim, a recess trim. The first then doing this off. This yeah, boon can let. This is a uh, trim. It's a ten centimeter by five centimeter. Uh, done by SCG. Love this stuff. Good quality stuff. Uh, all uh, that's finished now. I just walk through the dust. So we finished doing the catman on this wall, ready to box the pipe work in here. The ceilings is all done. Um, that's the uh, sun visors to go in. Uh, I'll show you where they go. Uh, getting there. Right, I'll explain. I'll go back to the, the water tank room. Right, we've started on this, but we've had some rain, so um, the site wasn't accessible for a few days. And there, uh, we need to jump back on to that. And here, I'll explain. And this will clean it all out, right? Right, so basically we've got the well outside, and that's the controller for the well. That pumps into this uh, mix sand filter, which has got a resin. Um, charcoal, resin charcoal and silica for this one and it goes into the tank. This tank will actually fill the other tank on the other building as well. Um, that's the pump for the house, a 300 watt motor. That's a two horsepower pump for the irrigation system. This here is a controller for the irrigation system. Yeah, This is a hunter system, uh, four zone. Uh, for the landscape work um, again what we've got on here we've got two float switches what the float switch does here is um, one is to when the uh, to fill a tank up once it reaches up then it'll turn the water off for the the well but if the water's too low then it turns the power off for the pumps but not for the controller or anything like that it just turns the, the pump motors off so you don't burn your motors out it's, a bit, it's always an essential to use a float switch on storage. And this, this is it, yeah, the box float switch. One of the models that we used. This is a 12 year guaranteed um, 1000 litre tank. Um, so, like I said, all this has got to be cleaned out. You still got the seal to put in and the light to put on. Um, Staff accommodation for some of the staff. Start putting the posts in now. I mean, they've got to be set up yet. Some of them are set up, some aren't. So, we've got to do that in the next year or so. So, we're just focused on the house right now. There you go. As I say, I love this. Uh, then it's uh, plaster uh, with the wax finish, you know, so you never need to uh, repaint the house every couple of years. It's good for at least 
eight to ten years before you have to re-wax it, you know. Depends on how much sun you get on. Uh, this egg doesn't really get much sun, so you might only have one more and you might have to re-wax in about five years. The house is looking good. I'll show you inside. Bad man. Mr. Movie Star. Uh, Gloy's a good guy. Him and it. Elvis. <laughs> he gets a nickname Elvis because he likes to wear sunglasses all the time. So basically in here, we got the vent out for the hood. I got that hood done, hidden out the way. Uh, ready for putting the spotlights in. Uh, the cassette air. We just wait on once the windows are fitted, then the tilers can come in. We do the tiling. So that's this one's ready. Just a bit more paint on there. The paint here. We're using Euro style windows with a 10mm thick glass. Actually, it's a soundproof, but also with a, um, like a built in care glass, like a UV um, protection on it. So, there we go. A bit rubbing down, we skim that bit. Details I keep checking over. I've got a light to put in, so there's another coat, the finished coat. That's only the primer. Another coat of finish on there. <coughs> Again, it's all been done. I'm ready to come on. That's his stuff here. And you can see how that's so a lot done. Uh, door frames off. Just need to finish rubbing down and there's an architrave to go on. All the way around. Uh, bathrooms. This is a guest bathroom. What we have for access points in every bathroom. We've got an extra access point for the networking in the utility area. So on this point, there's a hatch there. So we've got all it, this is all electrical. We've even got USB. So let me find it. Which one, which box it's in. Um, we always use these type of uh, distribution boards, consumer units. And you've got the safety tip, the RCBO safety on them, and regulate it. Uh, this one's actually for the uh, garage area. And then we've got the 12 here. So we're going for a silver, and no silver finish. And there's the switches, four way, three way switches. That's for the network. Uh, there you go, yeah. Three pin. All uh, with earth. These are Panasonics. I only use Panasonics. Um, we do have the USB ports. They're not cheap. I'll find it. Uh, that's all the covers. That's uh, the new build that we're doing now. So that's all the drones for it. Big shout out for Jen for doing the drones, my architect. That's a single. Yeah. Yeah, I'll show you more on that when I can find them. So I've got the box to go in there, sort all that out. Someone asked me what make of the spray paint that we use to guide GD395. Uh, non air compressor. Spray gun. Great, great machine. Yeah, giant, giant. Nice, boy. 
one of the doors for the guest room. Whoa, oh, oh, you're funny. Stay in. My die. Die, law. Okay. Oh, just. So today they're fitting all the frames, tomorrow we'll be fitting the glass. And as you can see, there's a network cable up there. That's for the um, extenders. So just level on the step on. You know, there's for the CCTV there. Yeah, they're around a few. Uh, as soon as they're all done, ready for the lights to be fitted, painted, and then fit the lights and paint the wall. All the walls have been skim coated, smooth, apart from the bathrooms. Yeah, no, that's all I'm ready. Solar solar panel trucks, solar panels. <coughs> uh, that's nearly about it. Like I say, these posts have been set in. Uh, so it's going to be a barbed wire fence around, but then this tree is going to be put up against it. You'll never see the fence, but just added security. We dug out for the wall, the entrance. So I'll show you the design on that. So, so that's all finished, Catman. Uh, rendered, uh, skim coated, uh, not skim coated. Um, Venice pla Vienna plaster, Vienna plaster. Um, that's it. So I'm really proud of that, this job. There's pie up on the roof there. She's doing all the, the fascia board, painting the fascia board. It's got lovely clear skies. It's a bit nippy today. It's about 12, deg 12 degrees in the night. Yeah, when I'm so used to like 30, 30 plus degrees, 12 degrees is really cold and windy. Um, it's probably about 26, 27 now anyway, uh, with a bit of wind. Um, there you go. That's the kitchen window. Starting to look more like the concept. So I've got the clients coming in a few days. Probably when you get to see this there, the clients will already be here, like, but yeah, I'm not too sure if they're going to be on camera or not. This is going to be. But there you go. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe. Uh, especially like it all helps the channel um, <coughs> and anyway sorry for the delay of videos it's been so busy but I'll try and get more out as soon as possible okay bye for now